You already know what it is. It's your boy Lay Back with another reaction, another review, another episode. Hey, Nukes Top 5. You up to bat. Bah, bitch, I'm driving a Bennett. Most of you niggas is lazy. Half of you niggas full gazy. Yeah, I be spitting that crack shit. Cause I was born in the It's your boy Lay Back. Welcome back to my channel. Hey, two things we gotta do. You gotta hit that subscribe button. I'm drinking this water. You already know what it is, man. Appreciate time. Appreciate life in 2021. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you hit the notification bell. Stay up to date with all the videos, man. All right, we back with another Nukes Top 5, man. Y'all wanted me to do more of these. Y'all know I've been missing, you know what I'm saying, in action because I've been moving and stuff. So, you know, I got it as dark in here as I can possibly manage. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, first of all, you know, I need you to drop with you in the comments, man. Let me know that you with me, you know what I'm saying, as we go on this journey. But yeah, we got uh, five Scary Ghost videos to haunt you for days. <sighs> so we here. Fire Squad. Let's get it. Top five ghosts caught on camera. The Screaming Ghost. Paranormal investigator Ross Allison has been heading up a ghost hunting team in the Pacific Northwest called A Ghost for nearly 20 years. After one of their investigations, a female team member believes that she was followed home by an unhappy spirit who attached itself to her. Afterwards, she says that every time she records her voice, unexplained horrific screams and growls appear on her recordings. What? In this clip, to prove her claim, she records herself in full view of a camera and a room full of people, which Why would make faking the recording nearly impossible. Why at night, though? Hi, it's me again. Obviously. No one can understand why you have to scream, and neither can I. Why do you follow me everywhere? I know you need my help, but I can't understand you. Please, can you just try to not scream? Can Why you try to tell me your name? Or what you'd like for us to call you? Daytime don't work, I have huh? friends with me. They understand things in the spirit world. We all want to try to help. I know you came with me from Rolling Hills and I told you you would never have to go back there. But now I'm thinking you need to go someplace else. I'm gonna turn it off now. Okay, let's see what we've got. Just as she claims, some terrifying voice seems to appear near the end of the recording, even though nothing could be seen or heard by live witnesses or in the video. Whoa. And once again, it's Meanwhile on TikTok. So I'm getting about 100 suggestions for TikTok ghost videos every week now. So I'm just going to include a few of the best and I'll let you guys decide for yourself. First up, the TikTok shadow person. The dogs are ready for bed. It's just a peaceful night here. Get ready to go to bed myself. What the f is that? What? Oh God, f Now, as you know, if you're a regular viewer, on, I man. don't comment on whether I think a video is real or not. But if this is fake, then this is a pretty nice effect. The f is that? The be that calm. 
Now, the person who posted this video claims that this incident actually caused them to move from this house. Okay, so everybody keeps asking about the shadow story and we no longer live in that house. We were actually going to buy it and that happened, so we They said fuck house. that. They said. As far as here, we haven't really had anything. We do have a uh, wooden picture on our wall that keeps falling down, but we don't know what's causing it. Um, we haven't had anything weird happen like the shadow at the other house. So that's the story on the shadow house. Next up, we have the restroom stall ghost. Why are you looking under the stall with a camera though? And then, last but not least. What's going on guys? Making a video, it's been a couple days since I made the last one. I'm feeling good. I don't know what the f that was. Yo! Hello? Hello? Yo, they be too calm and shit, yo. Nah, hell nah. What's going on? Hello? Jesus Christ, was behind me. Whoa! Oh, so, are these real ghost videos caught on TikTok? That's just a little or key. Or is it just a part of the latest TikTok spooky video craze? Now, I have about a hundred of these in my email, so I leave it to you to decide. That's wild. Or after reading. This next video was recorded by a Jordanian ghost hunter that I've never featured before named Mahmoud. In the clip, he's investigating an abandoned building that is said to be home to a powerful curse. As Mahmoud explores, he begins to find old crumpled pieces of paper inside the cupboards, but he pays them no mind. However, it seems almost as if someone or something is watching him as he explores the house's cabinets. And when he checks his footage later, he finds that there might have been yet another paper on a higher cabinet shelf that he couldn't reach. And this one almost seems to move on its own. And then, this is where things become truly bizarre. Mahmoud finds a bright red paper inside one cabinet and decides to see what it is. As he lays down the paper to examine it, the very floor beneath him seems to burst into what flame. He makes a quick run for it. Later, when Mahmoud examines the strange paper that he found inside the house, he finds a series of strange symbols in an odd, indecipherable language. So did Mahmoud find an actual curse scribbled on pieces of paper spread throughout the house? Or is it just an elaborate hoax? I don't know, that shit was crazy. You can check out Mahmoud's full video and his other ghost explorations over on his YouTube channel. A little pat on the back. The German ghost hunting group Andapava PE caught one of the most bizarre videos of a supposed apparition that I've ever seen. Andapava is investigating a haunted house in Eberstadt, Germany. The couple who lives there says that they've heard and seen very strange things, including the terrifying disembodied head of a little boy peeking out from inside their bathtub. Andapava did indeed catch strange electromagnetic readings inside the bathtub where the little boy had appeared. Mm -hmm. 
But creepiest of all, as the group walks into a hallway, their static camera catches this. Can you tell us why they are here or why you are here or why you are here? A small, pale little hand that looks like that of a child seems to reach up and touch one of the investigators on the back. The Andapava team says that they only noticed the incident after watching their footage back. Since there is only a brick wall next to them in this video, there was nowhere that this small hand could have reached out from. And if you think it might be the investigator, Chris, reaching around to touch his own back, it should be noted that the angle of his arm would be absolutely bizarre. And also, Chris is a pretty big guy and has fairly large hands. You can follow the Ghost Hunting Group's investigations over on their channel, and the Pava PE. The Cell This next clip was filmed in a mental institution in a southwestern city in the Netherlands. Now, I can't even remotely pronounce the Dutch name of the city, so I just won't try. But this footage was filmed in one of the institution's holding cells for patients under psychiatric observation. By the way, the institution was also a former prison, and this room was originally used as a solitary confinement holding cell. So obviously, the room has a dark history. One night, guards monitoring the empty cell security camera Notice something very strange. Jezus, maar. Nou, hij moet uit. Ik wil blij dat jullie het ook zien. Ja, echt. Ik kan mezelf twijfelen. Het is gigantisch. Nou, nu gebeurt er. Oh ja, net als in die films. Ja. The lights seem to flicker and fade, and then something dark and ominous crosses the camera. It doesn't look like a bug. It doesn't look like dust or a spider web. But just what is it? You decide. Yeah. All right, that was Nuke's top five, man. Five scary ghost videos to haunt you for days. That was creepy, man. We back, though, man. We back with the scary videos, man. Y'all been asking for them. I'm scared. Y'all like seeing me scared for whatever reason. But um, if you made it to the end, I need you to drop real one. I ain't gonna lie, it feel good to be back, but it's uneasy because you know I ain't really with the scary shit. But I'm glad to be back to be able to do these again. But I ain't really, you know, I ain't really fucking with the scary shit like that, man. That's just always been my thing. But if you made it to the end, I need you to drop real win. I missed you guys. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? I've missed you. But till next time, man, self-love and positivity. Fire Squad, I got you and you know it. Hey.